These are $8,000 Louis Vuitton Nike Air Force Ones. Now, I actually bought these as a personal sneaker that I didn't tell you guys about a while ago. This is a size Louis Vuitton 10. I've been wearing these for a little bit now, but it's time for me to go ahead and trade these. Now, when I'm trading sneakers, and want to get some value out of the sneakers this expensive. I thought, why not go ahead and do a mystery box? Now, on the used market, these go for about $5,000 to $5,500. So I reached out to a couple stores here in Atlanta and asked who would be interested in a trade. And the people that I actually bought them from a couple months ago actually are interested, and that is Request Atlanta. So what we're gonna do today, we're gonna take these shoes over to Request, we're gonna trade them for a mystery box in the store, bring the mystery box back here, unbox it, and see what we get. Now, I'm doing this because I like to get new shoes here on the channel, some new fresher stuff. It's fun to go ahead and do this rather than just having super expensive shoes like this. Let's go ahead, head to Request ATL, Say goodbye to these beautiful shoes. Let's go. It's giveaway time for one of the best shoes that's come out so far this year. This is the Jordan 4 Nike SB. We're gonna give away a pair in your guy's size. Rules are very simple, just one, subscribe to the channel down below. We're trying to get to two million subscribers. Be the first sneaker channel with two million subscribers. So go ahead, make sure you subscribe. Number two is to turn on post notifications when I post here on YouTube. So go ahead and click that bell down below. Number three is to go ahead and follow me over on Instagram and there will be a post over on that Instagram that you're gonna do the step number four, which is gonna be comment on the post that's up on the screen of me holding these sneakers and you're gonna tag two friends in those comments. We're gonna pick the one on April 20th, 2023. So go ahead, make sure you enter the giveaway, get you a fresh pair. Just got over to Perimeter Mall right here. It might be a little bit difficult to film in the store because it is midday right now. Not normally when we come when the stores is like rent just opening and quiet. So there's music and everything going on there. We're gonna try our best to film in there the transaction of the trade. We'll see what we can do. But again, request Atlanta. Let's head inside, get this trade done. It's just be us taking the box, getting them the shoes, and then seeing what we got back at the warehouse. You have to save this one for the second end of the video. This one? Okay, I see. Save for last. Purposely made this one crazy. This is gonna be a little subtle. The starter. The starter okay. and then you just it. The this one's just insane. Okay, decided for. So, I got two boxes instead of one big one. Saving this for last. We're gonna lock this in real quick. Ready for the trade. Thank you, bro. First one, two mystery boxes. <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. Come check out Request here from Ramal. We'll head back to the warehouse now. Took us a while to figure out the right stores and everything to do this trade and we finally got it done. We have two boxes and this one they said to save for last. So we're gonna put that on the ping pong table behind us and then go ahead and unbox it after. So we'll come back over here after and unbox that. He said there's a little surprise in there for me and somebody else's, I'm not sure. So we're gonna go ahead, open this up. So one shoe, roughly $5,000, $5,500 worth of value into these shoes here and we got a lot that we're gonna go for and let's see what we got. I'm seeing some stuff off the rip. First, we have a Mellow One. You actually have to have these in my collection. This is a Mellow One, this is the junior size. Obviously, this is the Galaxy colorway right here. Check these out. They released a lot of really cool Mellow Ones. We have a couple right here. These ones actually sold out when they came out. That's probably why they had these at a resale store. But value on these, I would say it's probably, oof, but I think they're GS sizing. So it's probably like one something, 130 maybe? I'm not sure. Nice one there, something different to start off. Nice little Puma Mellow. And then, another Puma Mellow in there. Wow, but let's pull these out. We have a non-box pair. He said this is appetizer. So he said this is just like chilling. We're opening some fun stuff, but nothing crazy. Everything crazy is in that box. So let's open this one. And ooh, that's not an appetizer. That's an off-white Air Max 97s right there. Check that out. A black pair in a size 12. That's a good one. No box, but still really good one. Love these from back in the day. Remember when all the off-whites came out? This is one of the great ones. So black pair right there. If I had to guess, non-box pair, maybe 400 bucks, 500 bucks, something like that. All right, so we have some Crocs. So this is one of the most popular Crocs that's been coming out in a while. Let's see what size these are. It's the men's 10, these may fit me. These are the Salehi Benberry Tide. This is the Pollux Clog, if you guys don't know. They're an interesting look. Look at that. 
this is a blue pair so they have the heel and everything back here but a lot of people wear these more as like fashion rather than like the crocs originally they're kind of like kind of like slip-ons or whatever i remember my grandfather he made us have crocs for his sailboat because he wanted to make sure those was like our sailing shoes was crocs because they're like safe on the boat and whatever but nice pair of crocs here this is totally this is different these are probably in the 200 like 150 to 200 range if i had to guess right there Let's pull out the other uh, Mellow right there. Same thing, the Galaxy in a size 6C. This one right here is a 7C. I'm not gonna go much detail on those. All right, then we have a size 11 Jordan 1. This is my size. This could be exciting. This is a newer sticker. This is a Jordan 1 Bordeaux. Definitely one that we've seen a lot here on the channel. Probably have gone up. Since they were like going for under retail when they came out. I think they're probably right around retail. Probably around 170 to 190 right now in that range. Size 11, good size, obviously it's mine. But that's a good one right there. Again, we're doing this, we're stocking up some inventory for the warehouse. Always wanting to have a lot more shoes to expand and put on the wall. Then we have another size 11. This is gonna be a Jordan 5 Varsity. This is the Raging Bull Jordan 5s right here. Check those out. Size 11, another good one. Higher retail, retail 190. And if I had to guess, they're like going for like 250. Trying to use my knowledge on these resale prices. The prices I'm saying are like stock X pricing, not uh, resale store pricing because resale store pricing is a lot Two more in this box we have a easy slide and another jordan one then we'll move this to the side eight pairs in the first box and let's pull these out jordan ones size nine this is going to be brotherhood ones i cheated and looked brotherhood ones pink and yellow pair this is an interesting colorway i think kind of harder to wear uh and style kind of shoe but nonetheless pretty cool and going for probably right around retail you could get these at the mall when they came out i remember when we got those jordan ones and a pair of Yeezy Slides. This is the Yeezy Slide size 10 Glow Green. This is time for summer coming up. Yeezy Slides are gonna come out. This is a size 10 right here. That's gonna be our first one. So let me, I kinda wanna set these up over there. I like to switch up the backdrop. So I'm trying to figure out how I can do this. All right, we moved all the shoes over there. I'm trying to calculate in my head how much I think those are worth. I'd have to say between 15 and 17.50 for the first box. So that leaves a good bit of value left in this box. Like they said, that was an appetizer. So let's go ahead and see what we got. We got a request shirt. I'm seeing that right there. Shot a request. Got a nice little shirt. I actually really like the neck lining on this. I need to find these blanks. This is a good shirt right there. Shot a request. Then we got another one there. One's a size large. One's a medium. I think that's meant for me and Sophie. I'm not sure. But, oh, I need to stop looking. All right, this is heat. I need to stop looking deeper in the box. So first off, a pair of off-white from the 50 collection. This is gonna be a size, looks like a bigger size, size 10 and a half, lot three. We all know we had this entire collection and these definitely went up to like 650 to $700 each. Check those out. This is a good one. This is one that had the purple tongue, purple zip tie. You had the nice purple there, really clean colorway and then had like the light purple there. So this is a great one, 600 bucks, 700 bucks probably. These definitely went up. This is a good size too, 10 and a half. A lot of these that we found when we got them, they were like size like eight and size seven. So that's a good one, size 10 and a half right there. That back there, should we go for the other off-white? No, let's go for the, a different one. There's an SB box right here. So that should be fun. Nike SB, rainbow box, size 12. We have, ooh, the Civilis Nike SBs. Yes, we have not had these in a while. If you guys don't remember, this pair, up, oh, it's not working. When you get it warmed up, it kind of go. the black goes away and reveals something underneath. Check that out, right there. If I take this into the sun, let's go in the front room real quick. goes away check that out that's what it looks like see the other side that wasn't in the sun look at that it's insane so the civilis sbs right there they have them at 780 i didn't i don't know what these are going for now maybe they're a little bit less a little bit more i'm not sure i just don't even remember these were like 400 at one point but check that out it's still holding strong definitely a cool design and a definitely a cool attribute of the shoe that is perfect for the summer now these might be used so got a little creasing there but pretty cool that it's like all black and you get in the sun and it's that so next up we're gonna skip did we really get another pair of these? This is a big size too. This is a pair of Tiffany Nike Air Force Ones, a size 14. That is a massive size. Size 14 Tiffany Air Force Ones. Check those out. We got a pair for retail on the Seekers app. I still have them, haven't worn them yet, but check that out. You got that big silver there. I thought this may be bigger on this pair because mine's bigger than like the size eights, but dang. The whole 25 bucks for the silver right there on the back. We got the Tiffany Air Force Ones, definitely a big release. These are selling at stores for around $1,100. That's 
That's what I've been seeing all the stores sell them at. On apps, they're probably like 900 or something, but that's the, the store price. This is a size 14, so maybe a little more difficult to move. So not sure the price on that, but definitely a good one. Some recent release, something good. So let's keep moving. Oof, I see a Cactus Jack logo. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna stop looking, I'm gonna save it. We have four more pairs and we're at 11 right now. So one for 15 pairs. So this is a off-white Nike Dunk. And I think this is another lot number three. Two of the same right there. And this is another size 10 and a half. If anybody's a 10 and a half, go on harrisonneville.com, check it out. You guys keep hearing me mention it, but we're on the road to 2 million subscribers, trying to be the first sneaker channel to get to 2 million subscribers. So go ahead, subscribe down below, turn on post notifications, and thank you guys for watching and getting us to 2 million subscribers. So. Another 10 and a half right there. Another one that's probably in the $700 range. All right, let's keep moving. We got a one no box pair, Yeezy 350. The no box pair, I'm kind of excited. Sometimes we hype it up and it's like not super crazy, but then sometimes it is. We'll save that for last though. So we have a Yeezy 350 in a size 10. This is the MX Rock. I wonder what prices of Yeezys are doing right now because I haven't seen much on them. I know Adidas is trying to mend their relationship with Kanye and all that. So I'm curious to see what happens. But this this is interesting. I've never seen this colorway. I think it's pretty cool. It's kind of like the mountain-ish vibes. They have the brown going on. All right, let's keep going. We have the Jordan 6 Travis Scott. So you can tell by the box. Got the beautiful dust bag here. Check that out. This is the khaki brown colorway in a size eight and a half. Boom, very, very clean colorway. Like I've said many times, Jordan 6s are not my favorite just because if you can see how wide that is, my legs are skinny and it doesn't look right. But this is a pretty cool pair. I haven't seen much of these lately. It's been a while since we've seen these. And then we move on to the final pair. Of all of these, check them out back there. We got all the pairs. We got one left and I hope I'm not hyping it up. I hope I'm not. I know there's, you can see it right there. It says Air Jordan something. I don't know what it says though. I'm gonna go and see the final pair. Oh, that is a heat. Is this my size? Size nine and a half. That is a shattered backboard Jordan 1. These are used, but this is iconic. One of the best Jordan 1s that's come out. The colorway is amazing. I'm a fan of orange. That's why I say it's one of the best. The color orange is the best on anything. So Jordan 1 shattered backboards, and these used are going for $800. So I think with the different amount of stuff that we got, I think that's pretty solid. We're obviously using rough numbers in our head, but definitely, we, went, we transformed one sneaker into all of these. Let me know down below what your favorite pair in the entire box was. You guys know, anything that's not my size, we throw on harrisonville.com, so look out for a drop soon. We're filling up the warehouse, and we're ready for another drop soon, so go ahead and check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like down below, turn on notifications, subscribe, get to too many subscribers, and I'll see you guys in the next one. This is Harrison, signing out.